this morning, new Greenville Mayor Candy Smith was honored at her church for being the first African American female mayor of the city. WNCT's Courtney Allen has more on what it means to their congregation. People packed the pews of York Memorial AME Zion Church Sunday morning to honor their member and new mayor, Candy Smith. The bishop presenting her with a certificate of achievement while the congregation sang songs of celebration and praise. When God has elevated one of our own, it's a poor frog that doesn't praise its own pond. So I want to thank God for this opportunity to be her pastor and to witness history. Smith making history as the first female African-American mayor of Greenville. Praising him for everything he's done for me, for bringing me this far. And I know that he's not going to leave me. So it just made me a little emotional. Inspiring men and women alike. I got three daughters and any kind of role model that shows African-American women that they can go and succeed, I, I'm all for it. She really inspires me to let me know that I can do anything I put my mind to. I don't want anyone to think because I'm a woman or female I can't do it or because I'm black I can't do it. I don't want anybody to think that. I think we can all serve our community. I'm in love. History has been made and I feel like there always should be change. There's always new things and her being elected is just amazing, especially for the African-American community. People say they're excited for what the future brings with Mayor Smith. And she will be the mayor of Greenville, not black Greenville, not yellow Greenville, not pink Greenville, not white Greenville, not red Greenville, but she will be the mayor of Greenville. In Greenville, Courtney Allen, nine on your side. Smith was appointed mayor last week after then Mayor Allen Thomas stepped down her time and the position though may be short. She doesn't uh, she does plan to officially run for the seat in November.